everyone it is Reed from Living Large Reptile Supply so today we're uh, gonna paint this boat a little bit not doing nothing fancy we're just trying to sell it the person that I got the boat from you can tell they sanded it and they were gonna paint it they just never got around to it so no one has even asked about this boat I mean it's an old boat it's definitely got some work to be done uh, so like I said, we're not doing nothing fancy. As you can tell, right there, there's some blemishes. I don't know if you can see it on this or not. A little bit of running. We uh, taped this down. We didn't use the newspaper first. I got a couple little red patches right there that won't come off. But as you can tell, the bottom's gonna have to be painted also. I'm not gonna mess with that. I'm gonna let whoever buys the boat do that, but I just wanted to get some red spray paint and we're just going to paint this top half so it looks a lot better. I believe the other reason why people won't even look at this boat is obviously the steering wheel is falling down. We need to pull out all these leaves and everything so today is cleanup day. First task is painting this top. Second task, uh, probably do another day. I'm going to try to figure out how to get this steering wheel column back up there. I don't really care if it works or not. Uh, there's this whole system but as far as uh buying this boat no one's gonna want to buy it when everything's just laying there like that so i'm gonna try to hook it up the right way and everything but no matter what i'm gonna try getting the steering wheel up there uh another problem with this boat which i'm gonna probably do later if the boat doesn't sell is there's a fuel line way up under here you guys can't really see it from here just out of reach um I think I showed it to you guys in another video. If not, I'll probably end up making one because I got this boat up in the yard now so I have room to work on it. And we're gonna try to get that and fix that so the engine will run. All right, everyone, so as you can tell, it's still drying. It's not perfect. I definitely didn't sand it down any more than they did or anything. So it's definitely not smooth. You can see all the little ripples. Anyways, coming down here you'll see where we stopped you'll see the nice new red and then the old color this is gonna make a huge difference on selling this boat you'd definitely be more likely to buy the boat with that color even with the little paint drops and everything else just even getting someone to stop from the street to look at it more people look at it compared to not but as you see over here, I didn't tape some of it somewhere along here. Right there you can see a little bit of the red splatter. But as you can also tell, that's going to need to be repainted anyway. And all this. So that's the next part of this. I'll show you it when it's done. Okay, I say, get a stick to get the tape out. And he pulls out a tiny, tiny stick. It kind of works. Don't get your arm on there. Voila. Yeah, after a struggle, I couldn't get the camera out enough to record. Yeah, she's a little too slow. What? This is him taping, you know, because I didn't tape it the first time. So he's really just putting a little extra tape over what I already did. Got to make it perfect. Yeah, because you did the hard part. All right, guys, she did all this. I'm just touching up a little. Those are our new neighbors. That's what we get to deal with now. Yay. I'm sure you guys hear that. Now, this don't really have to be perfect because there's a molding that goes on here that's gonna cover up a lot of this. But we still wanna make sure we get as little as possible just in case the new molding don't cover it. 
Oh no. <laughs> uh oh. This is gonna be the most fun part to paint, you know, all that room. Good thing you're not gonna be messing up. Now I am. That was all meant to look like that. covered up. I think it's ready for some paint. Alright, now we're going to Where did I put my... There's your envelope as it falls on the ground. I still hope I don't get a line right here. You might be getting a little painted. <laughs> All for these YouTubers, I will get painted. Oh god, there's a spider. <laughs> Where's the spider? <laughs> that is so gross. Oh, oh my Definitely. god, are they all over me now? Oh god, there's a spider on me. <laughs> Don't even. <laughs> I'm gonna pause it and move. Hey, look, there's a little smiley face. Oh, isn't it cute? And you're gonna try to ruin it. You are gonna ruin it. It could have been our signature. Tape all that stuff up there too. Okay, seriously, where did that spider come from? Probably off the bushes. Gosh, it feels like they're all over me. Oh, you untied my shoe. really sad we actually should pull that off. We have the best background sounds for our video. Mine is using that guy's uh, music. It blends in pretty good. Should use the roller and paint it over that. We'll give it another coat later and make it more thick. More thick. Some of what? The paper? Yeah. Okay. Probably not gonna work. This is what we end up with. No, I didn't get it. That's good. This is the most organized video ever. As you know guys, this is not organized at all. This is the last second thing. This is actually my grandpa's boat and he just wants them gone. 
So we just decided to grab this paint today and just do it real quick. Like we said before, we're not doing it to be perfect. This is definitely not the way I'd be painting the boat if I was planning on keeping it. But once again, this video is about doing stuff quick and cheap just to sell a boat. Not saying you should do it the wrong way, you know, getting the steering wheel on there, but not fully functional. I'm still going to tell the person it's not fully functional and they should go and replace that which I'd recommend it anyway because this cable is super old. But I would buy this boat personally for a project boat. That's honestly why we kind of got it is one of my grandpa's renters owed us some money and I wanted the GPS off of it and I kind of wanted a project. I was planning on doing all this stuff the right way. But then I got a new job. Didn't really allow it. As you know, I've been working on my shop forever. That kind of took priority over this, but now that it's summertime, I'm getting yelled at to get these sold. So we're just doing what we can real quick. I really wanted to keep this boat for myself for a year or two to go out crabbing and see how it did. Which, if it doesn't sell that quick and I actually get the engine running, I'll probably put it in my name and take it out. But as of right now, we're purely just doing this just to get it sold as quick as possible. You know, we're probably going to sell it for five or $600, so you can't really expect that much out of this when you buy a boat that cheap. You're obviously going to have to put a little more money into it yourself and do what you want to fix it up. about this side I don't know why it's working so much better on this side. Just go with it, man. Maybe it was the wind on the other side. Yeah, it it is all of a sudden not windy. Oh, there's a little spray. But this side's not so bad. Just gonna pause it for a moment. Probably. He doesn't know I was recording his face twitch. <laughs> Should probably uh, cover those. So you still do it even though you were on it's, camera. <laughs> it's just one of those things. I think it's the pressure of this. <laughs> it's the cutest little face twitch. You know, we should have probably moved this boat away from these pillars. I know. If you come up here, you can get it real good. Oops. Or get me, that works too. <laughs> That's for getting the face twist. <laughs> See guys, you can always get your woman back some way. I don't know if that got that over there, but it's probably good enough, at least for the first first coat. I smell something burning. I know. Huh. We are in a ventilated area. We are still inhaling these fumes, but that is not spray paint. No, that's that is something. fire.
clean. You kind of still see that line on that side, not so much this side anymore. Well, let's let it dry. Let it dry and we'll come back and paint it again when it's dry. Sounds like a plan. Well, guys, that's, uh... <laughs> that's, uh... What we got so far. Alrighty. Probably got paint all over me. Hopefully it's not over the green boat. I don't mm -hmm. see any. We will check back tomorrow when it's dry.